Alright, normally I'm just uh, sitting down or something, but I'm on the recliner after watching this game. Uh, because there is not much to talk about with this game and my thoughts. I've done a thoughts thing ever since uh, New England and uh, the Falcons two years ago. Um, this game was a defensive game, and the offense wasn't quite – I'm not going to say it's all on defense, like how the defense was played. There was also some bad offense, but – I didn't do a predictions thing for this Super Bowl, but I said to her, everyone to ask me, I'm like, uh, yeah, Brady is uh, getting upper six. I figured Brady would get an upper six. He did. Not in a – I mean, this is probably – I don't know how to say he, he had that one drive that he needed. And that second drive – he needed to at least get a field goal to, in, you know, put the game out of reach. He got the drive. And, you know, what's crazy, um, I was texting someone, and she, and you know, she she's not big into football or something like that. I mean, but she watched, I don't know. She might be big into it. I don't know. But she's. I was like, yeah, uh, yeah, Tom Brady's about to go down there and drive. And that's when they get, drove down there and uh, scored the uh, touchdown to go up 10-3. Um, Brady is 41 years old. Uh, I don't know how much longer he's going to play, but have you seen his um, – at the end where he's doing the interview and everything – He's trying to be humble, but I don't know how you can be even more and more humble when you've got six rings. Like, at this point, you, you just – I don't know how you even do an interview after winning a Super Bowl. He's got six. Um, he might even make it to seven at least, or maybe even eight if he continues playing. For my eye here, he could continue playing until he's 45. They give him at least one more Super Bowl, I would think, honestly, or even two. I don't know, I don't know, but this is crazy. Um, Thirteen to three. I, uh, you know, I was at least thinking we were going to see more points than that. You know, at least in the twenties or early, you know, thirties, but thirteen three. Um, overall, this got to be one of the worst Super Bowls I've watched offensively, just for me. And one thing that bothered me, I don't know what, what the Rams were doing, but Tar Gurley didn't get the ball that much. Um, that's got to be play calling. I don't think he was that, I don't know if he was still injured, but it didn't look like some of the runs he had. That was good. It didn't look like he was injured at all. So I don't know if that's just play calling or what. But honestly, um, I'm more of an offensive guy. So this is one of my least favorite Super Bowls. But I was still entertained because I, the defenses were still playing like very, very, very good. Um, but Tom Brady and New England Patriots and Gronk especially Gronk on that last drive did got had like two catches that were big. Um, Gronk the one to set up the run uh, to um, dang what is it uh, Michelle I think he is a rookie um, out of Georgia. So I don't know. I don't know who they're going to pick for MVP. I would thank Edelman, Julian Edelman, because he was, like, the only person that, <laughs> like, did, like, very, very good. But there it is. That's my thoughts on uh, this uh, Super Bowl 53. Is it 53? 52. I don't know. It'll be in the title, though. But... 
New England wins 13 to 3 in a Super Bowl that I thought would be better, but I still enjoyed watching it. But I will see you guys. Now, I know one thing I want to say before I stop it. I know you guys have been wanting to see my new car that I said I was going to do. I've had it for about a week and a half. I just have not filmed it and everything. Uh, that, that will be tomorrow, though. All right. If you enjoyed this, please smash that like button. Comment down below what you thought of soup of the Super Bowl, and I will see you guys next time here on the Tyler Keller Show. See you guys.